The last time I wore a mini skirt was when I woke my fine self up in here today. When I think of mini skirts, I think of my high school uniform. I think of uncomfortable. When I think of mini skirts, I just get really excited. I think of my legs, because they're my favorite part of my body. I do not own a mini skirt, but I kind of like this one, so I think I might own one again. If the waist is too big, it looks kind of baggy, or it just like falls down, which is not ideal. Like if the skirt isn't fitted enough at your waist, yeah, it does keep riding up. Oh, mini skirt gapping is a huge problem. <laughs> it makes like a gap between my back and the skirt, which I don't like. I think uh, one of the biggest issues I have when it comes to mini skirts is finding a skirt that's actually a mini skirt because I'm petite and it runs pretty long. Yeah, I don't like it when they're too long because I'm short and I like short skirts is because it makes my legs look longer. I actually think mini skirts make me look a little taller. Because I'm so tall, it's hard to find mini skirts that are long enough um, in the back more so because I have hips and a big butt. Usually they're too short since I'm already tall myself. I feel like mini skirts are just like a lot of work to find ones that like make you feel good that feel comfortable. I don't know how to do it. I would rather just not have to worry about shaving my legs and whatnot. A lot of the mini skirts that I've worn in the past just had a lot of spandex and stretch in them. The ones that are spandex with no real kind of control kind of tend to rise, so you feel like you gotta pull them down all day. The only fit issues I have with mini skirts is finding one that actually is true to plus size in the waist, making sure that there's enough room for the stomach and the butt. I know mini skirt is too tight for me when you can see a little bit too much of the visible belly outline which a lot of people are cool with, but for me, that's when I know it's a little too tight. I've had several mini skirt wardrobe malfunctions. If they're not form-fitting, then they kind of blow up in the wind. It's not work attire for me just because I have to like run around and climb up ladders and I don't want to show my kitty to anyone. Whenever the wind comes, you have to like hold it down and walk like a penguin or else everybody's gonna see everything. No mini skirt wardrobe malfunctions I could think of, but maybe mini skirt faux pas and like wearing them with Ugg boots. You know when a mini skirt is too short when you can't sit without your butt cheeks touching the chair. A mini skirt is too short when uh, you can't like bend down and pick up your keys. A mini skirt is too short if you can see the pockets of the skirt. A mini skirt is too short when I could just hear in my mind when my dad would say, Hannah, that's too short to walk out of the house in. A good rule for me is I try to have it touch like either my fists or my fingers here. I think everyone has that weird rule that came out of nowhere. I know mini skirt's too long when it's nearing my knee because then it's not mini anymore. Well, how can a mini skirt be too long? It's not a mini skirt. <laughs> This is the longest skirt I've probably ever worn, ever. I wouldn't consider this a mini skirt. I'd probably call it a mini skirt if it was like here. I'm not trying to show y'all all my cookies, but a mini skirt is pretty short, guys. Like Anything lower than where this skirt hits me right now, it's not a mini. I would definitely consider this a mini skirt. Like right under the booty. I usually wear shorts under a mini skirt, like spandex shorts. Thighs rubbing together wearing mini skirts is a problem, especially in the summer. I think when you're wearing shorts, that makes it better. Shorts are a great option under things because like right now I can already feel my thighs like rubbing together a lot. Chub rub all the time, yes. I'll probably put on a short slip under it because I don't want any lady bits showing. It depends. If I'm wearing a bodycon mini skirt, I'll probably wear a thong. Who cares about your panty lines? Wear full underwear. I tend not to wear the boy shorts or the bike shorts under a mini skirt uh, because for me, I'm afraid that I might show them when I move around. Usually just like my shapewear. I'm definitely gonna have a few shorts. My Spanx holding everything in. So Spanx shorts, Spanx shorts. Just get them together. I feel a little bit self-conscious today in this mini skirt because it's been a while since I've worn one. My weight like fluctuates a lot, so when I'm like on the skinnier side, I get kind of self-conscious about my legs. Sometimes in mini skirts, I feel a little bit self-conscious about my middle. Oh, I've definitely felt self-conscious showing my legs. I don't feel like my legs are pretty enough. I've definitely felt self-conscious in a mini skirt with having a bigger butt and hips. Walking around with it riding up in the back, you're always kind of like paranoid. Mini skirts are actually how I first found my body confidence. I thought it was an item of clothing that fit me really well and sort of showed me assets I didn't realize I had. I feel like mini skirts can get a bad rap, along with a lot of other items we wear out of the closet that may 
draw attention or maybe a little revealing. But you know, it's you get one body, you get one life. If you're so concerned about what I'm wearing that it bothers you, then you should get a hobby. I feel great in a mini skirt. I feel sexy and powerful in a mini skirt. I really like the way it hugs my curves. Really like the way it lies on my waist. Mini skirts rock. I feel amazing. I'm all about body, so this is like right up my alley. Mini skirts are awesome. Everybody should own one.